Our story begins in ancient Greece in 400 BC. At that time, man firmly believed that all things were composed of four basic elements, earth, air, water, and fire. But Democritus, a philosopher of that era, thought that these elements could be divided into smaller particles. In fact, he even gave them their name, atomos, which means indivisible. I crumbled this earth to soil, and in turn crumbled this soil to dust. Now, if I could reduce this dust into its smallest particles, these would be atoms. This beach appears to be a solid carpet, but on closer inspection, we see that it is made of millions of grains of sand. If we think of grains of sand as atoms and pack them together, they can be molded into any desired form. So it is in this way nature uses these tiny particles, these atoms, to build all things, the earth water, air, and fire. If air and fire consist of small particles, how can they rise? They would fall to the earth like a shower of pebbles. The man who disagreed with Democritus was Aristotle, a famous Greek philosopher. His philosophy shaped the thinking of man for the next 2,000 years. And so the idea of the atom was lost.